Okay, so uh, Graham and I have built this lockbox application which stores an eight digit code uh, on the stack and then prints it to the screen when we lock it. So you can see it's locked and we've printed the code to the screen. I've also made this exploit script which uh, if we type in DD will just interact with the high five one over serial. Uh, we can also send it the correct code. Uh, which is 6559 6559 FF7B FF7B and you can see that's unlocked it. Can now tell it to relock the device, reboot it, and lock it again. If we now type exploit, you can see that we've managed to successfully exploit the vulnerability in the code and get the secret out, which is 3D9C549E. Uh, if we now tell it to relock again, uh, we can wait for a bit. The only ch lines changed. Uh, we're like, then, so we're going to change to make the program secure is we're going to add this stack arrays attribute to the print number function. Uh, all this means is the, the print number function is the one which puts it on the LCD screen and because we've passed the secret to this function it's on this function's uh, dead stack frame and that's what we're doing when we're exploiting it, we're reading past that and printing it out back. So what the stack arrays attribute does is it'll tell the compiler to overwrite this area with zeros in memory uh, thus protecting the secret. If we now flash the secure version to the box and lock the box again, if we try and exploit it again we can see it doesn't work and the secret isn't there.